The Cleveland, Greater Cleveland RTA is resuming some services amid the coronavirus pandemic. Today, the transit agency reopened its park and ride locations. News 5's John Rutter explains what customers can expect moving forward. RTA riders will be greeted with brand new vehicles as the popular park and ride service kicks back into gear today. The new vehicles were put into service back in February before the pandemic halted service and offer some new amenities for travelers. RTA passengers can expect more services returning or changing this week. The Beeline Trolley is offering runs every 15 minutes on a modified route that serves the warehouse district. And normal light rail service for the Blue and Green Line returned yesterday following a construction project. For me driving downtown because of the way parking is downtown, it is a lot easier to take public transportation downtown because it goes right to where I, where I need to work at. So I just get off the bus and go down there. And even when coming home and the commute, you don't have to be in the stress and everything that's going on with the highway. Park and ride buses from Westlake, Strongsville and North Olmsted will take riders to the Stephanie Tubbs Jones Transit Center in Cleveland. These will run in 30 minute intervals. Before the service was shut down because of COVID-19, it ran every 15 to 30 minutes. The new vehicles feature seat belts, reading lights and even Wi-Fi. You can even knock off some work, you know, quickly, you know, even before you get in the office or just have some downtime just for reading and relaxing. Remember, if you are riding the bus, you do have to wear a mask. If you don't have one, you can pick one up at the Tower City or Windermere locations. Reporting for News 5, I'm John Rutter.